I, I don't know how to say it uh, weird. Uh, dry okay. but moist for everything. The forecast says cloudy, says Ocean Chief, but he says it feels moist. Astro Boy is coming around to complete his lap. We saw him miss a couple of apexes in the third sector. And he's going to cross the line very shortly indeed. This looks like it is fast. Crosses the line and goes fastest. Wow, a 1 minute 19.534. That is a very fast lap indeed from yeah, Astro step. Boys. Okay, everyone forming up then, and we are just about ready to get going for this first race of season two. And away we go. And look like a clean start, but a very good start from Ghetto. And he takes the lead. And a poor start from Astro Boys, who's all the way down in third place as they go around turn one. And uh, around turn two, we see the cars approaching the two Ferraris almost together as well. Bant just ahead of Triton, but down towards turn three they go. Copy trying to hang it around the outside of Astro Boys. A little bit of contact, but only a tiny bit. And Astro Boys does get the position down the inside into turn three. Looked like a reasonably clean start from what I could see. The two yep. Ferraris uh, behind Copy in fourth and fifth. Bantz has managed to get ahead of his teammate Triton, so a reasonably poor start from Triton and a very good start from Bantz. Right up front, we have side by side for the lead here as uh, Astro Boys having to defend against Get Owned. Astro Boys having to cover the inside and again, Copy under attack from Bantz as well as they head down towards turn oh three. Two God. cars side by side as uh, Astro Boys does manage to cover the inside line. Triton as well sniffing behind his teammate. Probably won't do anything too aggressive, but certainly it's a little bit of pressure for Copy with two Ferraris right behind him. Oh, and Bantz is making the move to the inside, or at least he's having a look there and I think they Almost came together. Almost very came nicely together. defended. It was good driving from both of them. Copy managing to hold the position. Vance Triton now. lurking. Yeah, Triton is lurking, and so is Jason as well. Two Ferraris again side by side oh, as they yes. head up towards the fast chicane. Vance might lose two places here because Jason is there as well. As they go onto the back straight, the third DRS zone. They will both, I think, have DRS. Both Vance and Jason. Jason trying to go around the outside into turn number 13. Ocean Equipment failure Chief. side by side as Ocean Chief. Uh, gets himself a penalty as side by side Jesse's into turn wall. one and get owned again I mean he's being squeezed out on the outside there and a little bit of contact between the two of them get owned I think it'll lose second place as well to copy who is just behind and side by side into turn three get owned just about manages to hang it around the outside I think he's gonna get the position because he has the inside now for the left-hander oh, oh it gets it a bit wrong though the the wow the <laughs> Triton goes between the right. two of them Incredible. Oh my god. <laughs> that was Incredible scene there. Very wow. close to being a huge accident, but uh, Triton just about getting away with going between the two of them. Jason not bothering to cover the inside this time. Bats down the inside and contact between the two of them and a bit of warp as well. Didn't see exactly what happened. They're still side by side into the right hander and Bats does look like he's got the position. Now he's past Jason. Triton though got a pretty good run there and he does have DRS now down this straight into turn 13, the right hander. Oh, and oh, almost into the wall. And he did hit the wall, but I don't think he hit it hard. Yeah. I don't think he hit it with the right part of his car, thankfully for him. Yeah. And I think he got away with it. Yeah, and he yeah, he pit. does pit as Triton has managed to undercut Astro Boys. So Triton leads this race now from the Mercedes of Astro Boys. And Astro Boys uh, coming under a little bit of pressure, I think, from his fellow new boy, Get Owned, as well, who is on one lap warmer tyres. Everyone on soft tyres now at the front of the people who haven't stopped yet. Yeah, has to defend against the Red Bull as they head into the tight right-hander onto the back straight. And they're going to be side by side, I think, here as they head up towards the fast chicane. Astro Boys and Get Own side by side. And Get Own, I think, will have it on the inside. Oh, just running a little bit wide there, Astro Boys. He, he cut some sort of a corner there. We didn't get a particularly good camera angle of it. But, and yeah, the exit was bad as well, but I think Get Own going to be able to make this move. He could get around the outside of Astro Boys there and Astro Boys might just have weathered the storm. So, uh, and oh, Hugo's getting it all wrong on the exit of the left-hander and uh, losing that P6 to Slash LP. Slash LP That's up the inside of Bantz into turn one. Oh, ran very deep in there and Bantz is, I think, going to be able to get oh, it on the Bantz. exit. Oh, no, Bantz! Into the wall in a big way didn't see exactly what happened to him but I suspect there was some sort of contact there and Bantz just getting 
an armful of opposite lock on the exit of turn two into the wall in a big way and out of the race don't see exactly what the situation is astro boys looks to the inside of Triton, Triton just has to leave a little bit of space on the exit. It was nice driving from him. He defended it very well. But the three of them now very, very close as they head towards the far chicane. Triton just has enough of a lead at the moment to stay ahead before the chicane as Astro Boys dives to the inside. That was a very risky move. And Triton has to cut the second part of the chicane and Astro Boys now vulnerable to get owned behind him. Who tries to go around the outside as they head into turn 13. There are six laps to go at the line. Get owned, Triton hanging around the outside. Not able to do it though. Astro Boys keeping ahead. Good stuff between the two of them. Uh, let's hope he gets out of the way. He even gives Triton a bit of slipstream there. And it's a 0.8 seconds between Astro Boys. Oh, oh no! Ice Ocean Chief runs off Astro Boys! The back... Oh no! Oh dear. Manages to get back on, but he's lost the third place to copy. And yeah, Ocean Chief just not really aware of what was behind him, I don't think. It's, uh, oh, the two of them very close now. Third and fourth. Copy and Astro Boys. Now, DRS better better now. Around the outside, oh he gets rested off a bit, I get memories of the Ocean Chief incident, he hangs up on the outside and now he has to run right on the grass of it, will he catch the car? Yes he will, so that is the pass there for you. Uh, copy down into P4. He's really on the knife's edge at the moment because he's got two more names. Oh wow, so. okay. Oh Triton with a penalty, oh, so Triton! Triton! <laughs> so that means Throws he's behind away. Get Owned, right? Yeah. That means he's, yeah, he's three seconds behind him now. So Triton suddenly from being in a position where he looked like he was going to win this race is behind the eight ball just a little bit because he needs to pull out three seconds on get owned. Yeah, which would be something nice for the end. Oh, and Triton catches a bit of dirt there. And get owned yeah, has a big advantage now. I think he's going to be ahead of him before he gets to the breaking point. And yeah, Triton has to fall in behind. So Triton now in P2 on the road as well as on the score sheet can they get own crosses the line and wins the Australian Grand Prix fantastic performance from the Red Bull driver second is Triton third is Copy and fourth is Astro Boys so Astro Boys not quite able to pull out the three seconds so there's your winner it is the new boy in the Red Bull get owned crossing the line first and beating Triton as well because Triton had that extra three seconds worth of penalties. Uh, copy with